I'm Grumpy, and welcome to another episode of Grumpy Outlaw Kitchen, where today we're going to go ahead and do a cucumber and radish salad, keep you all fresh and refreshed. All right, all right. Now for today's cu uh, cucumber and radish salad, twenty dollar price point. We have fresh radishes, fresh endless cucumbers, Greek yogurt, honey, white vinegar, uh, blue cheese olives, garlic, fontina cheese, and of course, dill. So we'll go ahead and also have our chives. So with that, let's go ahead and get to it. All right, so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna make our dressing. And what we're gonna do first is get our vinegar. And we wanna do about four capfuls. So just like that, one. There we go. Of white vinegar. And about four spoonfuls of your plain Greek yogurt. This part's important. So, one, two, and three. Just like that. And then we're gonna add honey. So add a little bit of that honey right there. Nice and sweet like. Just like that. And then we're gonna add for the last bit and garlic. Let me get a fresh spoon. Just like that. About two spoonful will do you. And then, I'm gonna bust out a whisk. Bam! And just whisk it all down until it's nice and creamy. If you have to add a little bit more uh, vinegar or anything like that, taste it first because you don't want to overpower it. You can always do too little, but you can never do, you can always do too much, but you can never do too little. So just like that, when we got a nice creamy consistency, almost looks like ice cream a little bit. We're going to stop for just a brief minute, get our black pepper, a few cracks to that, pink salt, a few cracks to that. Get it all in there. There we go. Nice and easy. Now all we got to do now, wait for our cucumber and our radishes. And we'll add this to that and have a salad ready to go. All right, so now it's been a half an hour when we let our cucumbers and our radishes and our olives sweat out a little bit with the salt. So now we're going to put in our coriander here, just like that and shake them around and make sure what we're looking for, what we're trying to do, and get them dry as possible. Make sure there's no more sweatiness on there. Make sure the water's coming out because we don't want them wet. We want them dry as possible. So now when we've done that, we'll transfer them to a smaller bowl here. 
repeat. Make sure all the sweatiness is gone. Cause you see at the bottom of my hand, there's got actual moisture coming out. We want to get all of that gone. So there we go. Just like that. Smooth and easy. And then what we're gonna do is dry out this bad boy. So now we're gonna go ahead and dry this out. Get all the moisture out of here. Then we're gonna go ahead and re-transfer all our goodness here back into here. Nice and dry like. And then what we're gonna do is go ahead, get some stuff out of the way, make a little room, get our knife back, and take our chives. Make sure you guys can see a little bit over here. Get our chives. And go ahead and just give them the good old dice down. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. We're going to go ahead and put that in our sauce. And now we're going to do and get a little bit of dill. About one sprig will do. And we're gonna go ahead and chop that down. I always pull out the stem. You can take the take the tip of your knife and you can run it right there just like that and get it off. Smooth and easy. Just like that. And all we gotta do, dice it back down. that in our sauce. And for the last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take our Fontina and go ahead and just grate a little bit of Fontina in there. Get a little love right there. Bang, boom, bang. Just enough, because you don't want it to overpower your sauce, but you want just enough in there to mix it in there real light. And one more good whisk. If it looks like a tajiki sauce, you're on the right path. Now all we'll do now, we'll take our sauce. There you go. Now last, last piece to put this bad boy on the plate, right? And here we go, guys. Cool, refreshing radish and cucumber salad. 